Good evening, ladies. How are you all doing? You do not need to adjust your cameras. This is Sandra, makeup free. So um, bear with me because we are just about to do a makeup demo, okay? So you, it is one of the most asked questions that we get asked is about the makeup that I use, um, the lipstick and the tan. So what I thought today is myself and Neva in the beauty room and I am going to go through my makeup for you again and show you what I use and go through a wee bit of detail. So don't be frightened, just make up free Sandra again. Um, but we'll get, we'll get on with it and we'll get stuck in and I'll go through each product with you, okay? So the first thing I've done, I've just got a little bit of moisturizer. You know I use the Shiseido at the moment. I'm using the Shiseido Vital Perfection Moisturizer. So that's just what I've on my skin. Um, and the next thing I'm going to do now is I'm just going to put on um, a little bit of the Advanced Night Repair. So you all know this one, okay? The first time I used I think you all fell in love with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to actually put on two drops of this. So this is Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair, okay? You only need one, one drop of this is enough, okay? You can use it morning and night. You can use it before your makeup, after your makeup. And I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna try and go through these steps quickly so we can really focus on the makeup. So I'm just rubbing that in my hands and I'm just tapping it, okay? If they, they says you use a butterfly sort on your face. So I'm just getting that on all over my face and letting you see. So that is my um, serum on my face before I start, okay? So the next thing I'm gonna use now before I get stuck into my is a primer. So a lot of you ask questions about primer. So the one I'm using is, the one I use is the Universal Estee Lauder Universal Smoother. But actually we get a lot, asked a lot of questions about people with um, oily skin or sweaty skin or how do you keep your makeup on when you're, well, I'm actually quite dry. So I use the smoother. Um, but this one here is perfect. It's called the Mattifier. And this is by Estee Lauder Shine Control primer and finisher so this will help your makeup stay on if you're oily otherwise if you're like me dry to normal i'm just using the universal perfect and the smoother okay so what we're doing is we're just popping a little tiny just one wee drop of that on our hands like so and we're just going to pop it in the skin and what your primer does ladies is your primer basically acts like think of your toast in the morning okay and your skin being the toast well it's like the butter goes on top of the toast so before you put on your marmalade and that's the best way to do it and what your primer does is it evens out your skin it smooths out it fills in any holes smooths over any dry areas and so your makeup what you put on top is just going to glide over okay so the one that i have on as i say is the, the um the smoother and that's for normal to dry skin i hope you can see that all right now so straight into the most asked questions the most asked question and we we sold out of it so quickly the last time i talked about it is what foundation do i use well, every single day I use the same foundation and I use Estee Lauder Futurist Hydra. Can you see that? I hope you can see that. Sorry, I don't know if you can see that. And the color that I use is tawny, right? So it's a really good big size of a tube. It lasts you for months and you need very, very little. Now, another little tip you can do is you can actually put your advanced night repair into your into your foundation and mix it if you want um but just for today i'm just going to show you how i use it so what you're going to do is you're just going to pop um some of your product on your brush okay it's a little squeezy top and i am using the color me beautiful um foundation brush that's got at the angle here um i just find it's really good for the bristles are really strong and it gives you a really good, good buff so i'm just going to get stuck and start using that now this one has got spf 45 i'm a big believer in spf because you know um there has been um we've had skin problems in our family so the future's hydro rescue tawny and it's got spf 45 it is really dewy it gives a really good coverage but it doesn't, it's not drying. And that's ideal for me, which who has dry skin. Okay, let's get stuck in. Just start onto the eye like that, okay? And just buff it out. You can see that so i've gone really sort of quite vigorously all over my face and i just get right in and around the hairline that's why i have my hairband on pull your hair back right in i bring it right down here like this so you're blending it in around the mouth 
and around the nose and around the eyes and inside the eye sockets etc as well because it's such a lovely light quality it's not going to cake around your eye area okay so what i'm going to do now so a nice layer of that on okay and if sometimes if you're like me and you're red and you need to do a wee bit over the top then just go over the top of it like that just a wee bit extra it's fine all right so you can see that real dewy payoff with that it's, it's that's just fresh on so it will soften down a wee bit but you're still going to get that lovely dewy look now if you are not dry or not normal and you actually are oily then what you need is the double wear the main double wear product okay so the color i wear again is tawny but you're just looking for the main double wear so double wear has got really good coverage it's excellent for someone who's got very dry, very oily skin it'll really keep that makeup on and backed up with your um primer um your mattifier so for oily skins this is the perfect duo so your double wear and your mattifier and then for someone like me who's normal and wants dewy, more youthful looking skin, you're smoother and you're futurist, okay? So you can see now that's sort of sinking in a little bit on me. And what I'm going to do now, and remember, I am not a makeup artist. Um, I've got a really good experience in makeup, but there's some real experts out there and I'm not going to pretend to be a real expert. So what I'm going to do now is going to put on a little bit of concealer because of the bags just under here, okay? Now, so the one I wear is the Double Wear Concealer, if you can see that. It's called the Radiant Concealer, all right? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop, it comes in, it's got a lovely wee soft sort of um, sponge at the top. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to three drops like so, okay? And I'm just going to do the same. Now, a wee tip for you if you look down in your eye like this it's called the magic v and what it's so your eyebrows create a shadow and it's sort of that's where you apply your concealer now remember under your eye is the most delicate part of your face so you need to be very gentle around the eye area so i'm going to actually use my ring finger just to to sort of tap this in okay so we're just tapping it in rubbing it very gently and you sort of bring it into the inside of the eye there like that bring it down and just push it up so what you can see is you're getting a really lovely lovely shadow there nice nice sort of light hitting that area where it sort of sort of contradicts that darkness that you would normally have so a really nice light um area there just do the other side Now, you can see how that looks. So right away, my eyes, that area there has just been brightened right up. Um, and you can see my base is all covered. It's not so matte or it's not a big canvas. It's not a big sort of sheet. It's There's there's definition to it. And that's because of the dewiness in that foundation and because the highlight that is in that concealer. So you can see that these areas are brightened. These areas are all covered. Um, and we've got a nice um, soft dewiness going on there. So what we need to do now is we need to apply bronzer. Okay. So again, that's what gives you definition. So I am going to use the one I use for, and I've been using it for junkies. Um, uh, I'm using this one. I use this one this summer because I used the the Chanel Universal Bronzer sort of for a body makeup, but this for a body shimmer. But this this has got a lovely one for summer. So we really really trying to focus on that summer look, and that's the Bronze Goddess by Estee Lauder. If you can see that. So if I just show you, it's got a lovely shimmery palette, a sh and I'm going to pop on the medium. Okay, so that's the Bronze Goddess. All right. So with your um with your uh, bronzer what you need to do is you need to think of it like a so you need to draw a number three in your face right so what you're doing so is you're just going over the top of your head like so you're coming down onto your brow onto your see your your jawbone here so you're coming down on there so round under like this so you're creating a contour there okay and because I have a round face, I really need that contour. And then you're coming around again onto the jawbone. So if you can see number three, up around onto the jawbone and under, or under the cheekbone and onto the jawbone like so. So just define that and that will give you really good definition. You can see the way that's really coming out there now. It's very hard for me what doing it in a wee camera, so I'll keep looking past you to the big mirror. And 
and you can see how that looks. Compared to this side, can you see? Real definition, and I'm just going to finish it off on this side. Can you see now that definition in my face? We've still got that dewiness in the face. We've got that lovely bronze glow now with the um, Bronze Goddess bronzer. And that's the one I use in the winter is the Universal Chanel one. In the summer I use this one because it's got a little bit more warmth and it's got a little bit more definition. Um, and it's really important that you keep your base, that in the summer months you don't take your base up. So you don't take your color of your foundation up. You just go a wee bit deeper with your bronzer because what happens is your face is too dark and the rest of your body isn't um, and it just looks odd. So you're better getting that wee bit of definition in your face with the bronzer. So that Bronze Goddess is my go-to for summer facial bronzing, okay? That's that wee one there. All okay. right, so next thing we're going to do now is I'm not going to go and... Now, another wee tip you could do if you wanted, I'll actually do it now for you is very quickly. Um, you can use this as an wee eyeshadow. So just to make it very quickly, so you can see what you're getting for your money. I'll just put a bit of thumb on my fingers. Makeup artist, please hold your breath. <laughs> because they'll be like, what is she doing? So I'm just gonna, see, you know, so sometimes the best instruments is your fingers for makeup application because you know what you're doing, you're getting control. But when it comes to, if you're just putting on a, like a wee bit like this on my, your eye, that's absolutely fine. Just use your finger and blend it out. But if you're obviously using, doing a wee bit more definition, then you'll need your brushes. But that's just to give you a wee bit there. Put a wee tiny bit, use my ring finger, just a wee bit under my eye. My kids will be laughing at this now because they say when you put on your eye makeup, you open your mouth. Um, and when I used to feed them, you used to, you literally, everyone used to laugh because I thought I was putting the food into my own mouth. I'm sure all of us women that have kids can agree. So can you see how that looks now? It's just giving you, and that's just that wee bit of bronzer that we use, that wee bit of universal bronzer. Now, and now I'm going to pop on. So I want to show you this um, because this is a mascara that I am um, loving at the moment. And it actually is a set. So it's my favorite brand ever, you know, Shiseido. And this one has a full size mascara, which I'm going to use. It's actually got a makeup, eye and makeup remover as well. So, you know, their skincare is top notch. So it's an excellent product. And it's actually got a free lipstick. Now, I would normally put that lipstick on to show you. I'll put some in my hand because I'm, but, but I want to put on the one I used to show you because she's always asked. But we'll put a wee bit of this on my hand. But the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put on the, the mascara. Now, I'm just using a tester here, right? So um, you're going to see. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into the bottom. You're going to wiggle. So just wiggle your lashes like that. Okay. And then we're going to go under. So get your mascara brush right into the root and wiggle it up. Okay. So you're right, wiggling it right to the end. And if you're like me, you just touch your lash. That's okay. We always do it. Just wipe it off with your finger if you're getting in there quickly. So. You want to really try and get that payoff on the lash to give it a wee bit if you're not wearing any eyeliner. And remember, in the summer, I, I know with the videos and stuff, I would have on eyeshadow and eyeliner and that. But when I'm off, I actually have very little. I just do this. So you're just wiggling that brush. And getting that length so just to hit my lash there at the top so i'm just gonna get a wee cotton tip and just blend that in use that wee bit of product and blend it in it'll actually be like a wee bit of eyeliner for you so just blend that in like that so can you see the difference now in my eyes so that's a wee bit of the bronzer in my eyeshadow and just the mascara um, so wiggle your mascara and lift up. And as I said to you before, I'd rather sweep my lashes out as opposed to up because I've got hooded brows. Sometimes the product, if my lashes, if the mascara hits, it will hit here. So I just find, I find the Shiseido one very good because it doesn't. And the other one is the Lancome Hypnos doesn't hit the lashes ne or the brow bone neither. But I just find a tent to sweep it out. So can you see how that looks now? I'm going to just do this other side very quickly. 
Okay, so I've just evened that eye up now. Um, and you can see now, so just a wee bit of bronzer as a shadow and the mascara there. And that's that wee mascara set. It was 32 euro, it is down to 21.95. We have a limited amount of those, so get in there. It's a full size mascara you're getting. And you're also getting, I'm actually gonna show you, I'll just show you that lipstick on my hand. This is actually what's inside the product. So you've got your full size mascara. You have got your eye and makeup remover, which is fantastic. It's great for lipstick as well. Um, that's, an, uh, that's a fantastic product. And as I say, the wee lipstick. I'm gonna pop the lipstick on my hand so you can see the color. Um, I would put it on, only I want to show you my other one that she's all asking about all the time. So I'm just going to show you the color of that. So look at the payoff on that. Can you see? So it's a beautiful brick red. It's definitely a color I would wear. Um, it's just got a really strong payoff. It's got, it's like a soft matte. It's not matte, so it'll not dry your lips out. There's a, there's a softness to it. Um, so that is the lipstick inside. That's, you're getting all that for 20... 22 euro or 21.95 which is from 32 so they're they're going to go so get in there quick and what i'm going to do now is i'm going to put on my lipstick that you all ask about so the one i wear the most is not flirting kind of jump in there's another estee lauder one that i've started wearing but i've only worn it one or tw two times and i'll show you that another day so it's not flirting by estee lauder or Lan sorry sorry it is by lancome so if you can see that, it's number 130, all right? And I am going to get it straight on, all right? So um, it's a lovely coral color. It's okay, <laughs> I don't know. I can't really see because I'm on this wee tiny screen, so I hope it's okay. So um, I think you can see now that, so you can see the definition the beautiful dewiness you can see the contour from the bronzer you can see the bronzer in my eyes you can see how my eyelashes that really elongated my eyelashes without putting too much product on them and um you can see the lipstick that you always ask about that's a really soft matte lipstick it's matte but it doesn't dry out it lasts all day um and at work i could be wearing this and then I'm, I, I take off my um, putting on my mask and you would i'm not as covered as you would think i'd be with a mask and remember then the primer that um, i'm just going to recap these products for you now so the instant repair the advanced night repair okay which is this one so this is your this is your sort of your serum that you're putting on before your moisturizer i love and breathe this boy here it's absolutely amazing it is so good you can mix this one drop into your foundation if you want for added um benefits and goodness but this is a number one best selling serum in the world i'm told and I think 98% of the users seen the difference within 28 days or something like that. So that's that one. Then we put on, I put on my smoother, which is my primer. Well, your primer helps your makeup stay on, gives you that lovely, even, soft, your, your makeup will just, it's like a, a wall. I use the toast analogy, but let's talk about primer on a wall. When you when you put a dry, like a new wall and you're putting wall pa or painting it, if you put your primer on your your paint looks much stronger you're getting far more out of it you know you don't need to use as much and the exact same applies for your primer with your foundation it is exactly the same so i use the tawny in the futurist hydro rescue this will last you for ages guys and the real good boy the good thing about this this guy is the spf 45 then i have used my concealer which is the double wear again and that's lovely payoff, but it's crease, it doesn't crease, but it's got um, longevity, which I love. Um, so it doesn't fall, if you go right up there, you can see that did not go in to my lines there. You know, there's, when you think there's a, there's a serum, there's a primer, there's a foundation, and there's a concealer on my skin, and it hasn't sort of gone into the lines. Um, and then I put on my bronze goddess bronzer, and I use that as a contour, as though I contoured my, remember the number three on the face? And I use that on my eyes as well, using my fingers. Sorry, makeup artists. And then I put on my mascara, this one as well. And you can see how that looks. It's not too, it's actually not, it's it's lovely. It's made a difference, but it's not too heavy load. Because sometimes if your mascara, some of these real 
you know, heavy, they say like false lash effect. They actually make my, close my eyes down as opposed to opening them up. Um, and this is 32 euro just to 21. You're getting the lipstick, the makeup and lip remover, the eye makeup and lip remover and your full size mascara. And then finally, I put on my Lancome lipstick. I haven't got this thing of it. Um, it looks like this and it's called Not Flirting, but all the links are going to be above the video. So I hope you enjoyed that. Another day now, maybe I'll come in and do just like a, maybe a BB cream or something. So say you're off on your holidays and you don't want to put on makeup, although this is very light, I'll just put on a wee BB cream and a bronzer maybe for you and let you see that. But if you have any questions based on this, then please comment underneath and I'll answer. Remember, I come into the messages underneath the video as Michael Honey's, but it's actually me. Um, if you're me if you're sending a Facebook messenger via Michael Honey's, you're sending it to the customer service team, not me. But many times they would refer and, and jump over and ask me questions, but it's not me. It's just, it's just me in the comments box underneath. So that is it, lovely ladies. I hope you've really enjoyed that. It's so weird for me sitting talking to myself on a screen. Normally I'm talking to Neve. Um, and I hope I didn't um, model you or I wasn't too unprofessional. It is very hard doing that. Um, so that is that. Some amazing products there, guys, and products that I love and breathe by. You know that, you know, that Tawny, it, as they, it sold out and it's, it's, it's only literally back in. Um, and Double Wear, Estee Lauder, you're dealing with top-notch makeup product. Double Wear is the best um, mascara or foundation in the world. But I'm using the, the future the future Hydra Rescue version of that. So nobody knows foundations like Estee Lauder. And um, yeah, so listen, I hope you enjoyed it. Any questions, please shout underneath. If you're asking about my, my moisturizer, I am using the Vital Perfection now um, in Shiseido. That's, you know, I'm a big Shiseido brand. I kind of jump between all of them, but at the moment, this is what I've started using for the summer. So that is it. I need the brows done and all that, but sure, we'll go into that another day. The The beauticians are nearly open, so hooray, pray to the gods. So we don't need to be doing too much. They'll be done for us. Anyway, listen, have a great evening. I hope that you enjoyed that. Sorry if it wasn't as professional as say Neve is not behind the camera this time. She's sitting here beside me. Um, and I'm sorry if I if I was jumping and jumping in between. It's just a little bit strange when you're doing it in front of the camera yourself. But anyway, thanks. Have a lovely evening. God bless. Stay positive. Any questions, just shout and I'll get in there and answer them as soon as possible. Thanks. Have a great evening.